Hi, welcome back to our US CPA Chica series. So for today, let's discuss the letter C of how to become a US CPA, the US equivalent college credits, the 12150 rule. So one, US equivalent. So since we are a graduate of a school outside the US, simply we just need to convert our college credits to the corresponding US equivalent accountancy program. So two, how did I do that? Where did I convert it? So there are a lot of service provider actually that caters for that. So what I did is I choose NASBA or the National Association for State Boards of Accountancy. So if you could see on the screen, in NASBA, there are a lot of states that you could choose from. So the 12150 rule, um, what I did on my end is for the 120, I choose New Hampshire to sit in for the exam. It's a lot of reasons, but um, we can discuss it further in a separate video. Um, next for the 150, or during the time that you're going to process your license, I choose New York because I'm working in the city. So that's it. So this is not sponsored actually, but go to NASBA. Um, you can see there the, the states that you could choose from. Uh, if you're not yet decided where are you going to sit in and where are you going to take, you could, you'll just avail the service, the second service of NASPA although it's a little premium to be paid. So for our next video, let's talk about let's talk about the P or the second thing for our how to become a US CPA. So stay tuned and don't skip the ads. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>